March 24th, 2021. Happy birthday to Jameson from Mrs. Quirk's room. Stay tuned for our core value announcement about patients. Have an awesome day, Bearsville. Would you consider yourself a patient person? How are you at waiting for things? It's one of those things that really takes a practice. At lunch today with your friends, discuss some different things you have trouble waiting for and some things you are patient for. Share ideas that share ideas of how you have patience. Today in history, on March 24th, 1989, one of the worst oil spills in U.S. territory begins when a supertanker Exxon Valdez, owned and operated by the Exxon Corporation, runs aground on a reef in Prince William Sound in southern Alaska. An estimated 11 million gallons of oil eventually spilled into the water. This would be over 11 Olympic-sized pools of water. Attempts to contain the massive oil spill were unsuccessful, and wind and currents spread the oil more than 100 miles from its source, eventually polluting more than 700 miles of coastline. Hundreds of thousands of birds and animals were adversely affected by the environmental disaster. It was later revealed that Joseph Hazelwood, the captain of the Valdez, was drinking at the time of the accident and allowed an uncertified officer to steer the massive vessel. In March of 1990, Hazelwood was convicted of a misdemeanor negligence, fined 50000 and ordered to perform 1,000 hours of community service. In July of 1992, an Alaska court overturned Hazelwood's conviction, citing a federal statute that grants freedom from the prosecution to those who report an oil spill. As you can see from the images, many of the animals were affected by this terrible crisis. Hey, we'd like to go ahead and end the announcements. Um, but before we do, we hope that you have a super day learning here at Bearsville. And um, we just want to remind you about this Bearsville expectations. Strive to do your best. Take responsibility for your actions. Always be safe. And respect everyone. At this time, we're asking everyone to please stand for the playing of the national anthem, and then you'll do the pledge in your classroom. Have a great day, everyone.